the roots of gridlock, the roots of women's ultimate New York, is just this, this like fierceness to persist in something that we love to do. Survival was formed as the first women's ultimate club team from New York City in the fall of 1982 to be able to be recognized as a professional women's team in any sport these days is significant. There's a responsibility there. It's important to recognize how far things have come since the beginning of Ultimate Among Women in New York City. Everybody was working so hard. You were a teacher or you're waiting tables. These women were doing some amazing things. PhDs, law school, journalists. It was a real scramble to sort of make ends meet. It's not like everybody got out at the stroke of five and could just easily make it to practice. I love this one. Th this sums it up. This is the post-game you know, action. There's the boom box and the dancing, <laughs> and the boxer shorts, you know, and the headbands. Um, and here we are, two, four, six, eight, 10, 11. Two, four, six, eight, 10. You know, 11 players and you were psyched. <laughs> Ultimate gave me the opportunity to say, hold on, how do we want to play it? Like, how does it work for us? It was really special to have ownership over our game. We should always enjoy it. And if we're not enjoying it, well, then we need to stop and talk and say, what, what can we do to make this better? Having survival at the game is so amazing. Some of them were the ones that I was, as a young female player, looking up to those veteran women and just thinking like someday I want to be there. Now they're on the other end of it, I'm on the other end of it, and now they're giving that energy back to our young players and that is inspiring. They know how much of a jump this is and how important this is for Women's Ultimate in terms of bringing women to this professional level. We already have a lot of people playing in college, in club, high school and middle school so not only is there an audience to watch but there's also a pipeline of players what pull is trying to do is add an option add visibility just to see high-level women competing and people caring about it is pretty radical 